All right, what's going on, guys? Um, so I've had a lot of questions about, oh, why can't you just copy and paste the tracks? Wouldn't it sound the exact same than recording them five different times? Uh, false. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you what it sounds like when you copy and paste the track. So I just have a little sanitarium demo here, and as you see, if you just record one track and you try and record copy and paste four different other tracks it's gonna sound not good the whole purpose of recording separate tracks is to make the sound fuller and uh, copy and pasting does not do that so I'll show you what it sounds like when you duplicate the tracks <laughs> Now, as you can tell, yeah, you can hear it on both sides, and yeah, it sounds kind of thick, but that's not the whole point of recording separate tracks. When you record different tracks, it's supposed to make the sound fuller. Copy and pasting is basically the same as just recording two mono tracks and panning them. They don't really necessarily pan, and it doesn't sound as thick as you want it to be. This is what the sound should sound like. Sounds better, right? Now both of those tracks were panned 80% on both sides, and I did the same as when I copied and pasted the tracks, and you'll notice there's a very big difference. Thank you guys for watching, I hope this helps, I hope this clears up some things about copy and pasting when you're recording tracks, and stay tuned for the next video.